This is the science of bums. Oh, the fence posts are all of Lydia bums. They said if you think of the legs of an animal as a pair of fence posts, between these pair of fence posts you will find a single bum. Now that is why people and birds have got two legs and a single bum. And that's why dogs and cats and goats have got four legs and two bums. And a centipede's got fifty bums. And a millipede has got five hundred bums. So science makes it possible to easily tell how many bums a linear animal has got. But octopus is a circular. And so the fence becomes more of a corral. And now science has uncovered the answer to this age-old mystery of how many bums an octopus has got. And it turns out using science that octopuses have got eight bums. That's a bumper leg, lucky octopi. But Pity, the enormous whale, because he's got no legs and only a tail. And so he can never do any boobs because he's got no bum. And that is why the whale is so big. You'd be big as well if you with a lifetime of poos because you've got no bum and that's why it's an extremely serious mistake to ever harpoon a whale because they'd burst under enormous pressure like some kind of hellish balloon What do you reckon? I don't think I'm overly convinced <laughs> <laughs> it's true, that's fact. Lucky girl growing up in this science-based family. <laughs>